guys and welcome back to the channel. It's Monet here. Yo, I am looking so bold right now. Like, oh my gosh. This maintenance vlog is about to hit so uniquely different because I feel like here and there, like, you know, I'll lose a nail, I'll get my nails done, I'll have like, I'll need to get my brows done, whatever, but like, this time around, everything landed on the same weekend, so like, this transformation's about to be unreal. Some damn lip gloss, uh, because one thing I do not need to be is ashy lipped. Thank you. If you're new to this channel, make sure you guys leave a like, please. Maybe subscribe, like, I'm very here this year and last year, and I got plenty of content if you guys want to catch up. Hi, I'm Monet McMichael, nice to meet you. <laughs> And if you guys aren't OG girly, comment down below. What was the first video you ever saw of me? Like, do you guys remember, like, when we met? Like, when did we meet? What was it giving? <laughs> We're going on vacation next week. We're going somewhere tropical and beautiful. And I'm just really excited to be so pretty. Like, I just want to feel so pretty and tan and just so gorgeous. Because <laughs> I've been working out. I've been eating good. I've been drinking my water. And now... We about to pop out. We about to pop out. So I actually just got a facial today um, from Coda Lee. If you know, you know, that's literally one of my favorite skincare brands. And I got my first facial from them on my birthday last year. So basically, I guess I just, it's a year later and it did not disappoint. Like um, they did really good extractions. They said I did a really good job at taking care of my skin. The hydration levels are really good. So I'm really excited about that. I'm trying to keep it up. In my last vlog, I kind of went into my skincare routine a little bit more, and on TikTok, obviously, I post a little more there. Um, I was going to take you guys there with me today, but I really had to just zen out. It was so good just to be there. I wanted to start the vlog right now because I'm actually about to get my nails removed. This is my last set. You guys remember when I had the bows? Yeah. Um, I think the length... I can't... I don't want to go shorter. Like, I like having long nails. So I think it's just the shape. I'm going to make it a little more coffin like because i definitely have very square um, i'm actually going to a new girl today so i'm excited to see how she gets down but she was like don't come in with anyone else's work on your nails i am not doing a refill over i was like oh period okay <laughs> she's about her business so i need to go get my nails removed before i show up tomorrow at 9 a.m oh ooh, ooh, the nails want to be sexy y'all so just nails tomorrow sunday we have lashes oh girl they are in dire need of my girl natalia and then my brows honestly the shape has been holding up pretty well i kind of just like trim them and pluck them myself here and there but when taya comes through with a lamination it always just looks so clean and crispy and then monday i'm getting a haircut girls so that's what's gonna be in store for this vlog i'm gonna get some inches off i'm getting some bangs and layers like i just want to be short and just like so That'll be fire. And then some waxing. I'm gonna schedule a coochie wax. We're gonna get our armpits waxed. I might even just throw a little packing in this vlog so you guys can head to vacation with us. And then next week's vlog is gonna be a little insight to me and Buki's one year anniversary trip. I'm not gonna be vlogging too much. It's gonna be more of like a cinematic experience, which I think is gonna be so fun. And I'm just excited to create it and just share it. Without further ado, welcome to this weekly vlog. And let's get ready to transform, baby. Let's get these nubs off. Drips the wrong address and now I'm late. Yay! Baby. genuinely art she did like the airbrush ombre i've always wanted to have the airbrush and it was so cool to finally see it and just the vibes that it gives like wow i think i'm definitely gonna get more airbrush work next because i just think it's so beautiful so beautiful i'm here for the gold vibes that's like my vibe for jamaica i got there at like 9 30 my set was done at like 12 30 and then jalen got his nails done and his took about like an hour which i was like hey his shit was so clean I'm obsessed. They're not too much either. Like, I just feel like they, they go 
they go with me. Like, you can't really tell. Like, it's not like I'm going to wear a hat. Like, I have flashy-ass nails on. I think the bow set was definitely, like, eye-catching. But these just feel like it's just an extension of me. I'm just so bougie. <laughs> Today's lash day. I literally am going to be so cute in literally, like, a few hours. Don't get me wrong. Like, we're cute. We are cute regardless. But, like, don't talk to me when the lashes on my my girl natalia is on the way make me perfect that's her lash account she's amazing you can lashes for a while huh girls Ooh. i'm also waiting to wash my hair until i get it cut tomorrow right after lashes is gonna be brows so i basically get my lashes done every three to four weeks lashes is a whole entire thing because it usually takes about two to three usually like th two and a half hours to get them done so I definitely had to work on my patience and I feel like I'm good now. And also I'm on my movie run. Like I've been on my movie vibes lately. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, you saw like my stories where I was talking about just recommend me some movies. And like, I just, when did you guys watch movies growing up? Because like, where the fuck was I? Because I haven't watched like any of the classics and I got like 15,000 replies <laughs> to those stories of y'all just like giving me so many recommendations. So I have a list together. And I'm trying to think of which one I want to watch without with my eyes closed because I'm really excited to watch How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days because absolutely everyone, that was like a top recommended one. I was like, damn, okay. Devil Wears Prada, I really want to watch. I just watched Clueless. I watched Breakfast at Tiffany's. I watched She's the Man. She's the Man was fun. John Tucker Must Die. I always thought like when I was younger when I heard that, I was like, that sounds like the scariest movie ever. Like, I don't want to watch that. <laughs> Jalen's also watched all these movies, so I'm like, okay, Granny. 13 Going on 30, Legally Blonde, Pretty in Pink, 16 Candles. I also think these are a lot of white movies. No shade, no tea. But like, even in my black ass and Puerto Rican ass households, like, I wasn't even watching those. I wasn't even watching no movies regardless. I love Disney movies, though, and I love kid movies. Like, I, Nemo was my shit. Monsters, Inc. was my shit. <laughs> Toy Story, you know what I'm saying? Like, obviously those OGs, but I wasn't watching those serious, real movies. I'll let you guys know what I end up watching. Ah, she's text me. Morning, on my way, period. So anyway, I'm gonna take a shower before she gets here. I'm really gonna clean my eyes. That's how you really get them to last long. You just, you gotta clean your lashes. Let's get into step two of the maintenance. Arguably, all these parts are the most exciting, but y'all gotta comment down below at the end which one you think is the most satisfying transformation. Let's take a shower. This is me testing the new mic, y'all. I got a new mic extension. Is it giving? I hope it is. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, holy shit. Wow. Every time you literally blow me away. Yay! So I changed it up just a little bit. Wow. I kept the length and the style the same, but I added a different curl for some spice <gasps> just to add density. But since you wanted a little bit more whiskey, yeah. I added the different curl on top just to add the extra whiskey. I'm obsessed with these. Which one is this one? This is the, oh, this is the actual perm? And the white one is the neutralizer. Yeah, see? I know my tea. <laughs> so that's like the whole point of lamination is like perming your brows and making them super like flexible, just easy to maintain. And then the wax on top is just like cherry on top. Sometimes like 45 minutes with all in all, like all our kicking and everything too. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> And the lashes took, we started at like 11.30, we're done at like 2.30. So it's a good like three hours. But it's worth it every time. <laughs> Do you have it with you? I think it's the same one, it's just different. we have a different lens. Oh my god. Aw, Sony cool. sisters. <laughs> Boom. 
the lashes, girl, the brows. After I get them laminated, they're supposed to be oiled up so they can like heal and just like cure. I don't even know. But she slapped on some castor oil, so they do look a little intense. By like two days later, they look perfect. So that's why I kind of planned it to get it on the Sunday and we leave on Wednesday so that they're gonna be, I'll be able to get them wet because you're not supposed to get them wet for 24 hours after. And lashes used to be like that, but now there's like, it's like an instant seal. So like I'm good to wash them and get them wet if I want. But I am obsessed with this lash set. Like she did them a little different. I feel like every time they come out, just a little different but they give like the same vibe. But the brows I want a little bit skinnier too. Period. Uh, I'm so happy. It's literally about 6 p.m. now, the sun is set. Like this takes an entire day, basically. So I was kind of like in and out of sleep with the lashes. Like bro, I was literally like, ugh. Tomorrow is going to be a fun day. I'm going back down to visit mom and visit my hairstylist, Christina, you guys know. So she's gonna go chop me up and me and mom are gonna go like have a little girls day get our toes done and honestly i'm wearing a really cute outfit so i, I kind of want to get some cute pictures and stuff so i'm gonna bring you guys tomorrow to a little mommy's water day and yeah you can come you can come back home with me and yeah hang out with cashew period see you tomorrow oh my queen ldr my queen good morning it's haircut day. Bitch, my skin is glowing. <laughs> it might be a little too intense. I've been really having fun slapping that shit on. Ah! I got my peppermint tea to start the day. Girl, I woke up at 5.30 this morning. I literally am just so iconic. I woke up at 5.30, willingly, and I got my ass up and I went to the gym. Cause I have a long day. I didn't go Saturday or Sunday. So I took the weekend off, I recovered, you know what I'm saying? I was really sore, so I think I really needed that. And then I woke up this morning just like fucking tired, but like strong. I literally had lots of energy. So I'm glad that I went. I'm gonna do a little bit of makeup. I'm gonna try to go while we're on vacay, like go to the gym, because apparently there's a really nice one on the at the place that we're staying. I don't know, I've never worked out on vacation, so I just wanna make sure that I at least had like few days under my belt at home because I don't know what it's gonna give like am I gonna go I don't know y'all believe in me are we going to the gym over there I don't know y'all believe in me or what but there's nothing like getting pretty before a fucking haircut though like I'm going to feel like a brand new bitch bro right now it's 8 30 my hair appointment's at 11 I get so impatient with my tea it literally takes forever to cool down but after my haircut I'm gonna link with mommy I have a call and a little bit of work I want to do so we're gonna hit like a little cafe or something and then we're gonna go get our toes done together. Like, I'm so excited. So I'll bring you guys along today because basically I think this is like my last day of the maintenance. Oh wait, no, we have waxing next. I'm scheduling my coochie wax tomorrow and I'm gonna do my armpits because they're wolfing, bro. And I'm wearing a shirt where you can like see my armpits. So I'm gonna do a little brighter. Yeah. Okay, so for the haircut, I've been going to my girl Christina for literally since like freshman year of high school, bro. So what is that? Bro, time, the whole illusion of time is so crazy. Like, the fact that 2020 was four years ago just, like, gags me out of this world. Like, what the fuck? What? It literally felt like yesterday. So, that's crazy. Um, then I graduated two years before that. Six years. And then another four. So, so like, okay, no. There's no way. It's almost ten years ago. I've been going to her. Ten years I've been going to her? Fuck that. Fuck that, I am not that old. I'm still young and fresh and plump. <laughs> I remember when I was younger too, I used to be like, oh my God, when my teachers would be like, I've been working here for 20 years. I'm like, God damn, bitch. <laughs> when I was younger, I was like, damn, you're literally, you've been working here longer than I've been, like, I've been alive. And I'd be like, so fascinated by that. So the fact that I like, can say like 10 years ago at this point, I'm like, damn, I'm getting up there. Anyway, I always get like a layer cut from her. But this time I think I'm going to go even like kind of shorter and more layers. And I kind of want a little bang action low key. At the beginning of the year, like I feel like it's so symbolic to like cut off that energy. Like your hair holds a lot of energy and like feelings and shit. That's how I feel. And I think just like start of the year chop is really iconic. Since I'm going on vacation, um, when you get your hair wet after like a haircut and it's all like fresh and shorter like my hair gets a lot more curly and like wavy 
So I'll be able to like scrunch it and just mousse it up and shit. So I'm hype about that. It's gonna look so fresh on vacay. Mm. The lips are looking juicy. This cover girl. I literally mention this shit all the time, but like just in case someone's gonna ask. But you can see like the brows already look a lot better than yesterday. I wanna put a little bit of gel in them. I don't know if I'm supposed to already, but just in the corner. This Makeup by Mario one is really good because it has like a little brush on the end and it's so creamy. So I literally just put like a little dot and then you can just like flick it like this. And it gives a super, but you can see, boom. Look how long my hair is. I've had this brush for probably like, probably like 10 years too. Ignore the armpits, okay? Snatching a pony is something spiritual though. I'm gonna put a little oil, this is the way. Once I like, after I straighten my hair and I finally go to a ponytail, I'll put oil in it every day. Just to like, make sure she's hydrated. Lay my edges. My mom literally, <laughs> it's so funny because my mom's been telling me a lot lately about the things that she like, wouldn't personally do about like my style and stuff. She's like, oh my God, Monet, like, did you get them long? Did you get your nails long again? I'm like, yes, mom. Like, I like fucking long nails right now. I understand it's not your tea, but it's my tea. <laughs> And she literally hates baby hairs. Like, she just does not get the edges moment. And I'm like, that's fine. And I was telling her, too, I'm like, I kind of give her some tips and stuff, too. I'm like, I think your brows, mom, and you're not supposed to brush your brows, like, straight up. And she's like, no, I'm going to wear them how I want them. I was like, period. <laughs> like, I think we both subconsciously try to give each other, like, little tips and stuff. But you know, at the end of the day, do what you want to do. Anyway, I like my edges. I feel very clean when I have them laid. And if you don't like them, that's fine. And it's literally 8.58 and that's when I wanted to, I wanted to leave at 9. So I'm right on time. So let's head down to South Jersey, let's do a little road trip and get this haircut. Hey girl, I'm back at the gas station. So what I was saying last vlog is that South Jersey is superior because we have so many Wawa's down here. Oh my gosh, and like it's my favorite gas station. They have the best. You know East Coast girlies get it, you know about Wawa. I literally would come here before every softball game. I would get a nice little hoagie and I would get like a breakfast sandwich. And like I literally grew up at this convenience store. But it's like on another level of convenience. So they have the most bomb gas stations. And uh, the city just doesn't do it like this. The city just doesn't do It's lacking. Cities be lacking in the drive through compartment. I have missed that luxury of just going to a drive through but I will say I'm still in Jersey so that I don't have to pump my own gas, which is so crazy. Like we're the only state I'm pretty sure that we don't have to do that. Um, so I just filled up my tank because I literally couldn't believe I put regular gas in my car. <laughs> I just filled up my tank, but I did premium this time. So you guys be proud. All y'all was screaming in the comments talking about premium gas only or fucking up your engine. I'm like, oh my God, bro. So only premium moving forward. But honestly, I should have asked for the receipt because how much is that? Okay, half a tank was only $35. Hmm. Hmm. Oh my god, gas prices really went down though. Remember in COVID when they were literally, it was like $10 per, $10 per gallon was crazy. Anyways, I'm back in South Jersey and I feel so happy. I literally am like, what? But I'm kind of shy a little bit because I'm like, if I see anyone that I know, it's just, it's just awkward now. It's just awkward. I just like, I'm like, hey. And some, oh my god, last time I was home, someone like, you know, we were acquaintances, like, I knew of this person, but they literally were like, how's Jalen? And it literally caught me so off guard. I was like, I, f like, I forget that people literally watch my life. And I'm like, how the fuck do you know him? <laughs> how do you know my boyfriend? I'm like, oh, probably because I literally post everywhere, but anyways, let's head inside. Hi. Hey, vlog. With my girl, Christina. <laughs> I literally vlogged this last time. I think I only brought my camera, like, once. Like, the big boy. Yeah. Another one like this. Same kind of vibe. I think I do want to do my bangs kind of like shorter. We haven't gone that short. I know, we? we always keep it like here. Let's do it. Because they are the first to grow out. <gasps> so like, like here. That is so crazy. Maybe not too thick, maybe just like a few. Okay. Like a skinny. All right, don't worry, don't don't freak out. I won't, I know you're gonna start sniffing. <laughs> I'm gonna see if she's gonna start no falling. Going back. <sighs> There's no going back. All I right. just wanna feel so light, it's gonna look bomb. All right, let's get to it. 
Oh, I'm kind of going to miss it though. This is like this. long. <gasps> it's going to thicken it up. Yeah, you need, you need it. All right. Ready? <laughs> There's no turning back. Okay. Like, like, she was talking about going platinum, I think, last time. Stop. Did she tell you that? No. Is she going to? I've been having fun with wigs, too. You saw I saw that. <laughs> how, okay. How do you get those on? Well, I have, someone come, I have someone come install it. That is, yes. like, skill. Thank you for the housewarming gift. That was so sweet. Awesome. Awesome. That board got so much use. Right? It's yeah. really great. Yeah, even for, like, serving, like, at parties and stuff. Like, I just, it's so good to have. It's my favorite. Oh. <laughs> That was just for fun. Okay, <laughs> all right, all right, I don't know. Good. I would've brought some, too. Like, you have them? I didn't bring any, but I was like, I would've brought some. And, yeah, I didn't even It's like a new cut, too, because I, I want to style it more. Yeah, like, you Like, once it was just like one, it's so all one length it felt like before. You have really pretty waves. And do you, do you, you don't wear it. Wavy that often, right? No, honestly, I don't. You should. Now you will be able to. Yeah, that's what I'm. That's what I'm excited for. Yeah. We'll leave it like yeah, that. I'll yeah. take it shorter after if you want. Yeah, this is good. Okay. All right, hang on one second. I have to grab some. <gasps> okay, it's cute. She feels short already. Oh, it's giving height. of your hair dry and then set it in the oh, rollers yeah. and when you do the top you just do everything going back. You'll be able to do it. Okay. I think yeah drying at 80% is the part that I need to do. I'm obsessed. Awesome. I love it. Yay. Girl the hair I'm so obsessed with it. This lighting is not gonna give what it needs to give but the layers she really heard me when I said I want definition in the layers like oh there's nothing like that post haircut Feeling. like I'm feeling like that bitch right now and I'm about to get my toes done I'm like do I get pink on my toes I feel like pink toes would be so cute do I just switch it up I always get white I might get pink I think mom's literally here at the same time I'm like is that her I feel like I heard that it's not like her beep <gasps> I was right oh she's locked out It says her car's here. <laughs> Hi. Wait, and she got her new Tory Burch. Don't play with her. Yes. Oh, your hair. Oh yeah. It looks beautiful. It's Isn't it she always so... looks great when it's freshly blown out. But yeah. I love the layers. It's almost my length. Kinda. Of. She took off like four <gasps> inches. The lighting's a little blown, but yeah, my hair is not. I let it air dry last night. I'm not like this is air dried. This is air dried. You didn't do anything to it. Well, I curl the ends but i just don't i like it when i blow dry it out it looks smoother well yeah duh <laughs> <laughs> duh when you style it it looks smoother but it still looks good oh it looks great girl i got whole bangs literally it looks good uh, i'm literally my mommy's daughter oh yeah you see my lip gloss mm. it's, it's gold yeah, yeah i can tell it has like it's giving y2k it's sheen <laughs> oh it's the i literally was gonna guess that mm -hmm. The Whitney Houston collection with Mac. Yep. But we're at the nail salon, y'all. We're about to get our tools done. I was saying I might get pink. A little pink uh, toe. Thanks. Are you getting your nails done too? No, I'm not here. I found my nail girl, so I'm like, oh. they don't look hard. Your little hands look so skinny and little. Girl, I've been I've been losing weight. <laughs> <laughs> it's a weekend and I already lost like 10 pounds. She said, you're going out. Tiny hands. No, for real. Like, you know, when we're Yeah, but your hands bloated. are little. All right, y'all, we're back at our roots, though. I was telling them, like, one thing about South Jersey, there's no traffic to Mom. I was like, I appreciate Wawa 10 times more. Mm -hmm. Just to pull up to the gas station. Oh, did you get... Oh, you got cashews? 
Yeah. And you know what I thought about? What? Like, you know, I didn't want cashew. I was like, oh my God. Damn! <laughs> we got the whole big bag of cashews. I figured you could take them home after, duh. <gasps> Thank you. Yeah. No, but mom was like, I was like, do you want anything to eat? Because I know she's going to get hangry, bro. And she was like, some cashews. And I literally, I can only think about him. And I saw her picture of cashews. I was like, some of these? <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm crying. Yes, but let's head inside. Let's see. Are you getting a I want, special color? Like, kind of like. Uh, a you little, always get something like that. A, not on my toes. I normally get like white. But I want something brown. Straight out the mud. Straight out the mud. <laughs> Then I get a laugh. <laughs> <laughs> the delayed ass laugh. I want something very coquet, something very ballerina girl. So I feel like maybe she. You have different eyebrows. They're laminated. Yeah, she has different eyebrows. So I brushed them. That's why we call you. Remember, you have the yeah. tattoo. You come and yes. I get the tattoo. You call yes. Thank you. <laughs> Hi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we um we moved. We moved. <laughs> sister, sister. Take care of mama. Yeah, I got to take care of mommy. Yeah. That's Bob Petty. Uh -huh. Dude, I've been going here for what? Like literally 10 years still too? I've been coming here literally since... Same thing with Christina. Me and Christina are going on like our 10 year anniversary. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy? Same thing here. I had my prom nails here. I had homecoming nails here. This is my spot. And my girl too is here. I think I told you guys about her before. Two. <laughs> Girl, I was so excited to see her. I was hoping that she was gonna be clocked in today and we caught up a little bit. The pink looks cute, y'all. I'm feeling a little Barbie. <laughs> I see you. Guess where I'm at. We're at mommy's house, about to see Cashew. <gasps> I always gotta show you him. I always gotta show you him. <laughs> Buddy. Hi, Cashew. He's so skinny and little. He's all groomed. Who is it? Oh my god. You look so cute, Cash. Oh my gosh, he's screaming. <laughs> he's screaming in silence. He's screaming. Oh my goodness, buddy. Are you screaming for sister? Do you love me? He looks so cute. Pictures do not do him justice. He's a little granny. They, they don't. <laughs> Cashew, you be a little catfish in the best way. <laughs> you are so cute. The idea of vlog sisters. He got a haircut. He looks so dainty and little. Guys, remember when we got Cashew? I was looking back at that vlog. He was a pupper. And he's still so little and cute. He's mommy's best friend, though. He is. And he holds it down. Give me some fun facts about Cashew. So he kind of sleeps in bed with us, but I think the bed is like too warm for him. So he ends up going like up and down on the bed. Uh -huh. And then he likes to sleep on my side. Like he's like my little guard dog, you know? <laughs> so he's always on my side on the floor. <laughs> and then if I toss and turn in the middle of the night, so like last night I was like this. Mm -hmm. He, if I, when I toss that way, he walks up here and he puts his paws on my breast. Mm -hmm. And then he stares at me. <laughs> and then he's like, are you up? Like, he'll, he, you know, he wants to make sure I'm up. If I'm up, he start, immediately starts licking me. Like, if I crack my eye open. And then if you're not he's up, like, yes, you yes! She's up! <laughs> I'm like, Cash, no. That's so cute. Yeah. It's a little creepy sometimes, because I'll just wake up and just see him staring. <laughs> <laughs> he's so picky, though. That's something he's funny about very, him. very... Oh my goodness, he does that shit. So well, even with his favorite meal that I always cook him, you have to like coerce him to eat it. So I like give him a little piece of chicken and then he'll like sniff it, lick it. You gotta make sure. And then he'll softly, he'll softly bite it. Cashew. And take it away. Yeah, I try to give him a chip. Like we try to sneak him something to eat in the kitchen. And he's like, mm, no. We're like, quick before mom, mom sees. I give him a chip, he's like, nah. How's it going? How's it going? That's good, bro. We just watched Devil's Wear Prada. Devil Wears Prada? I don't know, I wasn't really into it. You never seen it? No, Mom. Oh, babe. Mom, this is part of my movie list. Have you been keeping up my story? I have, I but I thought you watched it, because didn't you post something on your story about it? No. 
It was like she extra cunty or something like that. <laughs> that was um that was at Tiffany's. Oh, oh. Yeah, no, it's so good. I thought I could have sworn you watched it. Did you see um how to lose a guy in ten days? No. Put it on your list. I really want to watch that one. I should have put that one on. It was Gabriel. How is? How how's it going? Hi. <laughs> how's, Hi. How's it going? <laughs> Good. Better. <laughs> impossible. Oh. It's impossible to be any better. I feel like, like upbeat. I like kid movies. Yeah. I was telling them I was like, Monsters Inc. Nemo. <laughs> Those are my favorites. I tried to get you to watch the old classic. Nope. Like Cinderella, Snow White. Nope. Like when I always was a busybody and literally like always had to be doing something. Like she could not sit down like for an hour and a half. No, but we like, have been in a movie theater this year. It's okay. When she was older. Ah, when it was yeah, like, and I, see some of I, I probably think really the money. only movie I think I used to have to force her to watch a movie. Mm -hmm. Do you remember what was the first movie we uh, watched together? It was one before um, Hunger Games. It was one before that, and I was like, I can't believe you're going to a movie with me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, really? Something like that? Yeah. You know what is a new one? This is a new one. It just came out. You, you remember Outside, Inside Out? Yeah. The second part. I know. Now there, is, I like there, there are, there like are two, two emotions more. I, it's anxiety. Oh, it's anxiety. Anxiety. Without anxiety. Without anxiety. Without. That's me. <laughs> it's me. Oh no, it's not you. We should go see that. Okay. I would go see that. That card is like a crazy. <laughs> She's like, hi. No anxiety. He said there's two more emotions. Yeah. You know the movie, mom? Yeah. Well, I, I've never seen it. Feeling, sorry. I want to see that anymore. Yeah, he likes cartoons. Me it's too, no, Gabriel. One. Let's go. Yeah, the, the first one was so good. Oh. Uh, Gabriel likes kid movies, yes! Yeah. You know, did you ever watch Elemental? Elemental, it's on Disney. It was so cute! Oh, yes, yes, Elemental. It's like about the fire and the water and they can't love each other because like they're literally enemies. Oh, yes! Wait, 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 how's that movie? It's on Disney. Ah, anyway. I watched it and I literally was like crying. Yes, I saw... Anyway, vlog, good movie talk. Heading home now, and then we'll get to waxing for the last part of this maintenance vlog. Good morning vlog. It's the last part of the maintenance video, which is waxing. I actually didn't have time to get my coochie wax today, which I'm sad about, but it's fine. It's fine. I took an everything shower. I shaved my legs. I did my skincare. I went to the gym this morning, so my hair is kind of like worn a little bit, but I'm just, I'm obsessed, bro. I'm so happy I got a chop. I'm stressed as fuck right now because... I have a really important call in 30 minutes, which I'm just like, ugh, it already has my nerves spun. There's supposed to be a huge snowstorm, which is like, I know it's not gonna be a fucking huge snowstorm. It's delaying everything. My main package, I literally ordered everything on Revolve for this trip. They literally delayed the delivery of the package because of the said snowstorm. And I'm just like, it was timed so beautifully, like no later than Tuesday at noon. I placed it on Friday. I paid for that overnight, like one night shipping. So I was like, no, like Monday, it's gonna be here, period. The fact that it's literally arriving Wednesday because of this fucking storm is just blowing me. And then I also had another plug with Hanifa that I was so excited to wear it. Like I love Hanifa and we're building a little relationship I'm really excited about and they have some gorgeous dresses they were gonna gift me to wear. And they're closing down their office because of the storm for the day. So I'm on a time crunch with that one. We're trying to coordinate kind of like an Uber delivery maybe idea because I won't be able to get into the city in time and pick it up. And then part of me is thinking even, I'm like the flight's gonna be delayed for sure. It's tomorrow at five, it's tomorrow at 8 a.m. So, I usually am not the one to like kind of panic a little bit, but like I genuinely don't have anything else to wear. Like I was just so excited to just put these stunt in these outfits. And I'm just really hoping that there's an option I can go pick it up at UPS. I'm really trying to figure out any other way to figure this out. But the camera's actually at 1%. So I'm actually gonna just film for TikTok and insert the waxing. I'm sure I'll be saying a lot of the same things because I, I need to 
<laughs> I'll touch base a little bit when we start packing and I'll hopefully give you a good update about where all my clothes are and um, how the packing's going. So I'm gonna try to do this one with no reaction. Light work, no reaction. <laughs> the last part of the maintenance. Uh, hair done, nails done, everything did. Lashes, brows, now we wax in. Oh! Uh, there's supposed to be a huge snowstorm over here on the East Coast. It's just so annoying because I know it's gonna be just a few snow flurries and it's actually just delaying everything. I hope I'm not jinxing it right now because our flight tomorrow is at 8 a.m. I placed one order of really bomb outfits. <laughs> that I was so excited to try on and like pack together. And it was supposed to arrive yesterday. And now it says it'll be here tomorrow. So my flight's gonna take off before the package even gets here. <laughs> so I'm literally gonna miss my delivery unless I figure something out. And honestly, with how this is going, my flight's probably gonna be delayed anyway. So it's okay, it's fine. Oh, that's what I get. <laughs> oh, fuck. It's fine. <clears throat> Look at that. I haven't waxed since like Thanksgiving. Anyways, y'all, everything's gonna work out how it's supposed to. If I'm supposed to be on this flight tomorrow, I will be. If I'm supposed to be butt naked the whole trip, I'm supposed to be. I love me some snow. I love the cold. I'm a January baby, but I'm way too excited to catch a tan though. Like, <laughs> yeah, get into the roots. For all balls. Fuck yeah. TikTok, the videos are so short. So if you want to hang out some more, come hang out on YouTube. But hey, girl, hey. I don't know what I ended up editing for the pack with me. If I did edit something to make it look all dandy and fucking cute and shit, like props to me because this has not been fun, honestly. Um, I have two leaks in my house right now, which is just making me want to cry. Last thing I want to do is leave my house like this. Oh my gosh. The storm has honestly thrown a curveball on everything. I did not get my revolve order. Like, bro, you couldn't just drive up the street. Like, I drove to UPS. You guys couldn't just drive it to me. I drove to UPS and they were like, it's in transit. Like, it's in the back of a truck somewhere. Like, we just can't get it to you. You, you have to wait till tomorrow. I was like, there's no way. There was like, there's no way, sweetie. No. So at this point, I'm like, I wonder if the flight's going to be delayed. Um, luckily, I got my Hanifa three Hanifa dresses, which they're really cute. So I'll just slay them. I'll just dress them up. Other than that, I'm like, honestly, it's fine. I'm just gonna go enjoy and just layer up all my jewelry, all my jewelry. I'm pretty much packed, but I'm just annoyed that like, this is the state of my house right now. Oh, the leak, it's making me so upset. Like, are you serious? Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, this is not real. Luckily, my mom's available tomorrow to come house sit for me. I'm just stressed. And honestly, I'm about to wrap up the vlog right now. But I hope you guys enjoyed this maintenance vlog. It was really fun to create. I'll definitely do one in the future when everything falls in the same week again. Like, this was very, very nice that it all landed on the same week. I needed everything done at the same time. So I'm gonna go enjoy celebrating. With Buki, I'm really excited. And yeah, stay tuned for a little Jamaica sneak peek next week. And I'll see you guys in the next video.